The All-Star Game itself on Tuesday night, of course, a sellout, but you can still get tickets if you're willing to pay. Local 12 Jeff Hurst looks at how much. Hi, this is Sam. Can I help you? Here at TicketBroker333Seat.com. Demand for the All-Star Game is ginormous. Were you looking for the All-Star Game itself or one of the other events that weekend? All-Star Game tickets are going at around double to triple face value. 391 to uh, 3,000. Uh, 391 is going to put you in the bleacher. 3,000 is going to put you in the diamonds. And you never know who might be sitting next to you. We've sold tickets to people in Australia, Japan, South America, Germany. We've sold tickets across the United States from California to New York to Florida. I mean, we've seen interest from around the world for this event. Just be on first base in the infield box. These are great seats. I'm a Reds partial season ticket holder, so I have my own tickets to the All-Star Game. It is an event of a lifetime. I didn't go in 88 for some reason. So this is the first and only All-Star Game I will ever, ever go to. My tickets, I consider them priceless. I wouldn't sell them for anything. Well, I don't know. Make me an offer. Jeff Hirsch, Local 12 News. Oh, good for you. Have fun. There are going to be a lot of celebrities in town. I mean, who else can afford these tickets? Tickets for the Monday night home run derby, they're also above face value, but not as much as for the game. Tickets for Sunday's minor league futures game and celebrity softball game are actually under face value, some as low as $15. What a deal. There is a special section at local12.com for all of our all-star coverage and a link to road closures that are going to be related to the game. Since